being a soldier to me means sacrifice. It means that I've chosen to embrace selfless service, to know that I'm serving my country. I have a purpose that's beyond myself. My name is Captain Wena Andrews, a 70 Hotel Medical Operations Officer with the DC National Guard, currently assigned as an active guardsman at the National Guard Bureau. My parents immigrated from Liberia, West Africa, a couple years before I was born. For those who may not be aware of the history, the country has been devastated from civil war that happened in the late 1990s. I'm the first in my family to serve in the, in the military. And as a woman, it's even a bigger impact, the fact that I am in the military. Because traditionally, and especially looking at what happened during the Civil War, a lot of women didn't have strong, prominent roles within the community or society. And in 2005, Liberia actually did something even more groundbreaking. It elected its first female president, President Ellen Johnson Sirleaf. And she was the first woman to be elected to any country on the continent. That particular moment in history, it helped me realize that I could be a change agent, that my voice matters, that if I wanted to impact an organization or my community, that I'm empowered to do so. Since I was a child, I've always been into civil service. And I knew that the National Guard would give me the flexibility of staying within your local community while serving. And I knew I wanted that aspect when I was looking at becoming a soldier in the military. I would say being in the National Guard, it sets you apart from your peers. It gives you a leg up when you're trying to navigate your career. It gives you invaluable skills, such as leadership, team management, being able to manage multiple projects at once, and being flexible. Not only am I making my family proud, but also my fellow citizens.